it's saying uh, type to Siri. Okay, I'm gonna go in there, ask Siri to square 271. So I came into the house a few hours ago after having had lunch and I found a notice laying on the floor just at the entrance of the house saying babysitting, tutoring, pet sitting from neighbors, not strangers. We are local students with 4.5 GPAs offering tutoring in math, English, chemistry, and biology. <laughs> well, GPA goes up to four. I don't know where he got 4.5 from, but assuming that you guys might be Mr. and Mrs. difference as well. Like if we're talking about 4.5 GPA, then it's like calculating 73 times 48 in just one second. <laughs> Lol. Anyway, guys, hello. It is 3.58 p.m. and it's Wednesday, November the 13th of 2024. In about 30 minutes, I am going to leave for my drum class. So if you haven't seen yesterday's video for majority of the video, I was at the arcade. I was playing some of the games at the round one arcade center that had recently opened. Not so much to ask about it because it was only my first time in the round one arcade center yesterday and I'll be looking to go there again and again. Let's see how they run their business because there are some stores that only get to operate for like six to 12 months for bizarre reasons. There was this zero and store that had opened at the beginning of last year. And by last year, I of course, I mean 2023, because not in so long from now, it's going to be 2025. And as we are already now in the middle of the 11th month of the year, it is November the 13th. Now about this zero and store, you know how they would usually serve ice creams or frozen drinks as well, milkshakes, but they also serve like cupcakes, muffins, brownies, etc. all those sweet stuff. But for the last two or three months, they had kept their doors shut. Like I walk around the mall and I find, hey, what the hell has happened to Zero End? And it tends to be the lack of popularity and also the lack of customers that come in per day. Like for example, there was this burger restaurant, which was initially called Ruby's, but then they changed it to something else last year, which would be like a fast food place. And as far as I know, they have shut their business down too. Again, like a quick drop in the popularity or the customers per day rate in the restaurant. I'd be like, ah, oh, bullshit. How the hell am I gonna go there again? It's just freaking crap with the economy, you might say. In the drum lesson that I had last week, I talked to my instructor about this E. coli virus or whatever the hell that is that has been raising these concerns about going to McDonald's. This E. coli thing that was discovered to have been in patties and I think like 49 people got sick from it. I'm not quite sure, but it's just insane. Cheers and videos of coyotes. Yes. The hell took this immigrant seven seconds. Into a rock school and look at me. A Blink 182 outfit. Now I'm in the drum studio and how about something different? Two and a rabbit and a turtle, three and a four.
And that ends it for today. What a Wednesday this has been. But as you probably know, I am not going to be doing a vlog video the next Wednesday for a major reason. Which I am not going to talk about for today. But other than that, really, really busy. I also went to the Apple store to get a new cover for the iPad since the old one, like whenever I would take it out, then it would be quite difficult putting it back in. And I got this new one here. Like, look at that. Like, I, I, I had problems trying to, like, I thought that this battery may have been dead, but then I plugged it in. It was at 16%. Now it's at 20 and like somehow I can turn the volume up. Like I can't even do that now. How weird. And this is so awkward. I'm just gonna take this off. Hopefully it's not hard to take this out either. Oh, wow. I guess you might've just heard it, but I accidentally took a photo screenshot i want to say ah oh, there we go that was kind of hard okay so if you see these stuff i guess that's what's really makes it difficult to handle this ipad but if i try taking them ah oh, yeah there it is man these stuff is weird stuff huh there i took one and now for that other plastic part it's just gonna be crazy. Mission successful! Now I have a clean cover. And this is D30 protected. Now I'm gonna put this back together and hopefully I won't have any further problems. Now, let's just, what the? Okay, well the thing is doing it saying, uh, Type to Siri. Okay, I'm going to type to Siri. Let's see how I can type. Well, it doesn't even let me do it. Crazy. Oh, my. oh all right. Okay. Okay. I'm going to get Siri to multiply 73 by 48. That would be 3,504. Okay. Now I'll try something else. I am going to ask Siri to square 271. It's 73,441. <laughs> Dope. <laughs> All right, then, guys. So that's going to be it for today's vlog episode. I'm going to rinse myself off in the shower and put myself to bed after what has been a really long day. And I will see you guys tomorrow.